Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Good morning. Time to go to work. 40 miles an hour and a 55. Doesn't seem normal, sir. Thank God, Redeem. WGTS 91.9. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's Friday, 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 Friday. That doesn't really mean anything to me. It's not like it's the weekend and I have like all this free time. No. Uh, but I'm in a really great place and mood. And uh, last night I started my night job and it went really great. I was so nervous. I thought I could possibly just throw up everywhere. But God worked it all out, man. You ever like get in these ruts and I don't know, sometimes you just don't need to rely on God as much because you got it. Like it's your daily routine, you know, you don't really get much unexpected stuff. And then when you do, it's like still within your realm of being able to handle it. And it's just really interesting. And I don't, I don't know, it was beautiful really because it stretched the crap out of me. I was like, I mean, it was crazy, but it was good. It was a good reminder that maybe you should do things that you're scared to do, that you're fearful of, because then you rely on God. Because if you stay in a comfortable place, you won't ever stretch beyond what you can do and what God can then come in and do. And it was, it was a beautiful lesson learned. Um, just a little thing, little things where you just have to like meet new people and you're kind of introducing yourself, deciding who you want to portray yourself as to these new people, you know, especially if you're hanging around the same group of people all the time. They, they already know your past, your present, you know, like they know who you are, your quirks. And sometimes, you know, when you meet new people, it's like you get to decide who you want to be. And it's not like you're being fake, you just get to decide. You don't have to tell them your whole entire life story. Um, you can tell them what you want to tell them and they can discover other parts of you. And it's, it's, it's really cool. It's actually what I discovered when I went off to college was I was with all of these high, like high school friends since elementary school daycare days, you know? And they know everything about you. They know everything that's happened in your family. They know everything that you, like every class you took in school, like your academic level. Um, they know your, what you, your style. I mean, everything you could know. And it's not because they're like studying up on you. It's because they spent day, daily days, daily days. They spent days with you, like every day of your life for 18 years, some, some of these people. So when you go off to college, it's like you get to be whoever you want. You can share that story about um, something that happened in your life or you cannot. It doesn't just define you. So anyway, it was like I was starting college yesterday and it went fantastic and it was nice and just refreshing and I'm really excited. So I'll tell you more about it as the, the months and days progress. Um, but it was, it was good. It was really good. So today is Friday. I'm going to work. Busy day, obviously. Um, and I've got work tonight after work. And then um, maybe some hangout time with some friends by some fire. Anyway, good times. Really good times. People are being nice to me again. I opened up the door to my office and I found this. Yep. People are too nice. Too nice to me. It's like, love you guys. Oh my goodness, just add it to my little freaking sweet table. I'm at a bonfire, but it's awkward, so I can't talk loud. 
It's not awkward at all. Oh, she's been talking the entire time. I have, but not in front of a camera. <laughs> no, it's really You don't nice live every second of your day in front of a camera. I, I wish I did. I wish I had Hashtag her. truth, huh? Hashtag don't you Hashtag get truth. smart on the vlog. She's not gonna use that color. No! You're not leaving. I am. Is it 10 o'clock? Are you leaving? Say hi to the vlog, you love it. Why? Hey y'all. Oh, Justin does love it. Oh! Ham. Hammer. Why? What happened? Do you overheat often? She overheats all the time. And you have to go to the hospital? Yes. <laughs> we were there last night. Because she overheated? One o'clock in the morning, I'm sound asleep. She Are you serious? She calls me. Daniel, I'm really hot. I said, I said, go take a cold shower. He said, absolutely not. Take me to the emergency room. And then what did serious? they say? They said, your boyfriend is really loving and caring. Aww. I said, I know I am. Is this real? Tell her that, yeah. Not any of that is real. It's all real. It happened last night. Huh? It's all happened last night. Seriously? 